。电价审议委员会将在六月二十七号再度开会，不过现在因为国际燃料居高不下，估计这次的涨幅不小。而这波调整对象，除了可能用电大户，还有豪宅。Speculations of a rise in electricity prices are not coming out of left field. Oil prices worldwide have reached a high of 110 U.S. dollars per barrel. The government is looking to level this cost. There may be an over 8% increase in prices here in Taiwan. Over at this bakery, the owner is concerned about the possible surge in bills. Because our electricity use is very large, because our oven needs to be charged every hour. Charging the oven every hour is expected to increase. So we have to adjust the bill every month. Every month, we have to adjust the bill every month. Every month, we have to adjust the bill every month. Every month, we have to adjust the bill every month. Every month, we have to adjust the bill every month. Every month, we have to adjust the bill every month. However, currently larger households and bigger energy consumers are thought to be the ones that will see an increase in electricity costs. And it is estimated that for an average household with a consumption level in the range of 330 to 500 kilowatt hour, as well as stores, will likely not be seeing an adjustment in prices. 台电公司会在那委员会报告说，发电的这些国际燃料哈，每一天燃气的价格的这些飙涨，那对台电的发电成本的影响，哦，他们就会审酌，会有一个。明确的一个区分，哈，大概是怎么样的一个度数以上以下是怎么处理 ？With rumors swirling of a possible increase in prices, the Ministry of Economic Affairs is calling for citizens to not believe in all that they may be reading online. They have stated that any adjustments made will be in accordance with the current global climate. They will review the finances of Thai Power and CPC Corporation and pay attention to the impact of electricity prices on people's livelihoods. Whether prices will be altered is still under consideration. The Ministry of Economic Affairs has also announced that newly built or houses under construction will now have to have a certain capacity of solar energy, and details of this will be revealed around the end of the year. TVBS English News.